as you guys can tell, I already got ready. Um, the next clip that you guys are going to see is me getting ready for work and blow drying my hair. Because I took a shower today. I felt like my hair was too greasy and I didn't want it to go to work like that. I kind of wanted to look semi-decent. So I put a little bit of this acne foundation. Where is it? Right here. The acne uh, fighting foundation just for um, the little breakouts that I'm having, which is not a big deal. I get that um, because of the mask, my face is going to be a little bit um, weird right now, but we are going to work on it. We're not going to pick our face because that's the worst thing to do. I learned the hard way. Like right here, I used to get a lot of big thick stick acne, like this big, and I used to pick on them. And now I have like this little scars um, that I'm trying to get away. But I wanted to show you guys, try to fade away. <laughs> I'm trying to show you guys the... Um, serum that I use. Well, it's a cream. It's the Sea Rush Brightening Gel Cream by Ole Henriksen. I've been talking about this for months now. I love this so much. I haven't used it in a while because, you know, work has me all over the place. Like, I don't even remember my freaking um, skincare routine. But, um, that's what I'm doing. And I'm gonna go ahead and make some coffee right now and I'll catch up with you guys later. and stuff like that um if i look like my makeup is all over the place it's because i fell asleep for a little bit like maybe five minutes and then i woke up and i'm like shit i need to film a little bit more i haven't filmed anything and this vlog is gonna be so boring so i'll just fast forward that and then i think i'm gonna wash my face do a facial and um probably, probably put some mask on because like as you guys can tell i still breaking out but this ones are getting better like I can see it is getting better so I'm drinking lots of water too and I'll keep you guys posted but I'll catch up with you guys later
on my second gift when I run out of paper. So I think I'm gonna just um do them tomorrow. I still have like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven more to do, and the rest I'm just gonna put in like this little uh, gift bags because they're easier. I'm not a good wrapper, so you guys are gonna see me struggle and rip the paper all, all the time. So um, I think that's what I'm gonna do. So, the first thing I'm gonna do before doing anything else is take off my makeup. So I'm gonna put this hair up, and I'm first gonna show you guys what I use um, for my to remove my makeup. So the first thing I want to show you guys what I use to take off my makeup is this Bliss Makeup Melt. I literally use this a lot. Like, I'm running low. They have the big bottle, but I don't see the point of me getting it. I use it, use it like this. Take off everything. My mascara. And the, uh, the, what I like about this thing is that it doesn't burn my eyes at all. I usually use two makeup wipes just to get it good. So I'm just, I think I'm just gonna put this part of the video of me taking the makeup off, and then I'm gonna fast forward the skincare because I don't wanna, I don't want this video to be too long. But I also wanted to show you guys in this part of the video, like the stuff I use to take care of my skin. So. And I need to bring the aloe vera one second. Ole Henrinson or Henrinson, I don't even know what it's called balance and this is the cold plunge pore mask and this is the pore balance sauna scrub it also has the cleanser but i ran out so i use a different cleanser now and then after i'm done either doing my facial this is the, the stuff that i use to do like a facial to see my face to open up the pores and then i got this at amazon i'm not sure how much it was but i'll probably link the link down below to see if um we can still find it i still have the box by the way and then I have the vacuum facial pore cleanser over here. I use this for the blackheads and then it's also good for like to get all the dirt out of your skin and on my nose I have a lot of blackheads. I was getting the facials three months in a row like that's what she recommended me so, so it would get rid of the cystic acne that I had and then it did. Um, I haven't been with her I think the beginning of this year so I have to go before the year ends or when the year starts the new year because it's every six months now because i already did the three three treatments that i needed to do so now uh, i use this in between because i don't want to you know clog my pores this acne that i'm experiencing right now it has to do with the face mask i was using the surgical ones that people use in hospitals you know the reusable ones the not the reusable ones the disposable ones that you use once and then you throw away but i think the chemicals in that mask is what is doing this to my face so i bought a different face mask that has more cushion and it's a good also i got a toner that is supposed to help with mask me i think that's what it's called i'm not sure and it's the make back uh Sika toner this is hydrate and calm and you're supposed to use this every time you put uh your face mask so you put it on first and then when you get out of whatever whenever you're getting the face mask out you put it on, on again and then you just spray it on your face as usual it also claims to get rid of like really red skin and stuff like that i don't experience that like hyperpigmentation and stuff like that i don't experience that thank god but um that's that and also what i noticed that helps me a lot with my acne scarring is aloe vera this 
is the plan. And it is the best thing to do when you're breaking out. Like, it helps you calm, like, the pimples and stuff like that. Like, yesterday I had a pimple right here and a big one right here. This one diminished a lot. And I love it. So, I really recommend this. I don't even know where my mom got it. I think at the grocery store. I don't even know. But anything that has to do with aloe vera is always, always good. I will put the link down below for the Ole Henderson Pore Balance line. And then the Mika, the facial steamer, and then the pore vacuum cleaner as well. Um, those two, the facial cleanser, no, the facial cleanser pore, or pore cleanser, I don't even know what it's called. And this, I got at Amazon, so I'll link, I'll link the links down below. But... I'm just going to speed up the process of me doing my skincare so I won't bore you guys.